How's it going everyone? In this video, I want to talk about a losing trade I took on SPY today, kind of give you my thought process, the why behind the level, why I managed my trade like I did. But before we get started, be sure you're subscribed to my channel, click that thumbs up button, and click that bell icon so you do not miss on any upcoming videos. First off, this was based off of you know a data trading strategy. Plus, if you look on the hourly time frame, we do have a resistance around this 405.5 area. So I told everyone, I said, you know, we had some data that pushed us up here, as you can see, pre-market. I said, okay, I want to see a slight break above that pre-market high, which was at 405.45, and that's where I want to add puts. And I want my second ad to be up at 405.7. If we push up there, which is right at the bottom of this supply zone that I'm watching, I said I'm going to manage my trade. I'm going to keep a 60 cent stop loss from my original ad at 405.5. So my stop was at 406.1. Okay, I kind of keep like a general rule of thumb that 60 cent stop loss. And I want to say this before I go any further a 60 cent move on the ETF or stock that you're trading using options should never blow your account, should never hurt you enough that you're gonna lose sleep over it. Manage yourself accordingly, and if you don't like trading same day expiration, simply don't. Trade next day, there's nothing wrong with trading further out expiration. Some people prefer same day, some people prefer you know Friday expirations, whatever works best for you. Keep in mind, when I'm trading same day expiration, it's hard for me to sit and watch that premium because it fluctuates so much. It adds you know stress, anxiety, so if you're trading same day expiration, do yourself a favor. Do not watch the premium. Watch the chart. You got to accept, you know, there's a little more risk with same day. So we come up. This is the opening five minute candle here. Took it off this. We pushed on up. I took it here right at this level. This uh, 405.5 area. My next ad was up here. I took the 405 puts. I was in same day expiration. I had three different opportunities to sell this trade in profit. Okay. But I was being patient. I wanted to hold. I had a nice price target down here, a break below this 405. I wanted my first trim to be there. It's not the best risk to reward, but anything off the open is a little higher risk anyways. I like to trim my positions. And I cannot stress enough, 20, you know, 25% trades, there's nothing wrong with this. That's not a bad trade in my book, okay? Trim your position, manage your risk according to your game plan. That's all I do every single day. I trade the exact plan. This was the exact plan I gave everyone pre-market on my Instagram live. There's no hiding this from anyone. If you, you know, I call out what I'm trading personally and I call out when I stop out. That's one amazing thing about Team Bull. You know, we win and lose together. But one thing we always do is practice risk management. Some, you know, some members, they trade differently than others. They have more of a tight stop loss and that's perfectly okay. Whatever works for you, that's what you do. I only can say how I manage my trades personally. This is the only losing trade I've had all week, which is, you know, really good. I'm very happy with this week. If I can, you know, if I'm trading four or five days a week and I only have one losing trade a week, that's okay with me. This was last week of the first quarter. Volume was a little low. Price movement was not good with the same day expiration that I was destroying premiums. This wasn't your typical week, okay? So if you survived this week, you've done well. Let's come back and crush it. And that's all I have. I appreciate you all for watching. As always, be sure you're joining me on Instagram Live every morning, 8 a.m. Eastern Time to around 8.45 a.m. Eastern Time. Every single morning I go live, free education, watch list, all that good stuff. Be sure you're joining me. That's all I have for you all today. Hope you have a good weekend. Appreciate you all for watching, and I will see you next time.